During testing, you may need to call one test from another. This allows you to implement conditional test execution, reuse tests, and make your test runs more flexible. For instance, if there's a sequence of test actions that needs to be included in several tests, or run in the same test multiple times, we can save those actions into an individual tests, and then run those tests from other tests, rather than re-recording the same actions over and over again. You can then call these tests at a certain point, or when certain conditions are met. With Test Complete, you can create and use tests of various types, and the two main types of tests are keyword tests and script routines. So let's talk about how to call the different types of tests from keyword tests first. So I'm going to go on to my main test right here. And to call those other types of tests, you use these special keyword test operations. Run keyword test, load test, script routine, and then the general run any kind of test command. So let's talk about how to use these special operations to call tests. So let's suppose we have a script routine called routine 1, and we want to call that uh, from this keyword test. Okay, to do that, we're going to grab this run script routine operation and just drag it right here onto our test panel. And now test complete pops up this dialog that asks which test do you want to run. So we'll select routine 1 and click OK. Now routine 1 takes some parameters and test complete is now prompting you to specify which values you want to enter for those parameters. So we'll say uh, my value 1 and my value 2 and click OK. And now when we run that routine test complete will pass in those values to that script. Now we can also call other types of tests from keyword tests. For example, we could call another keyword test from this keyword test. So let's say you can see right here we've got our test1 keyword test. Let's say we want to call that as well. To do that, we simply use this run keyword test operation, pull that right onto our test, and select which one we want to use. And again, we'll just say test1. This test also takes a parameter. We'll just leave it with the default value that's there for right now. And now to run this, all we'd have to do is click the Run Test button. And then Test Complete would run through. It would perform this log message operation. Then it would run our script routine, routine 1. It would log another message. And then it would call the keyword test that we'd specified. OK, so we've seen how to call tests from keyword tests. Let's see how we can call keyword tests from script code and how to call script routines from each other. So to do that, I'm going to come back into my test complete project and I'm going to expand this unit 1 node here. Now you can see we've got this script routine called routine 1. And if I want my main test to call that routine 1 test, all I have to do is type in call routine 1 and then the values for the parameters that I want to pass. So my val 1 and my val 2. And if I want to call a keyword test from a script test, all I have to do is type in call keyword tests dot and then the name of the test that I want to run, in this case, test1 dot run. Now since this keyword test also takes a parameter, I can pass that in as well. And now I'll pass in my val3 into that keyword test. And again, now when we run this routine, we just have to right click on it and say run current routine. Test complete would log a message saying that routine one was called. It would then call routine one. It would then log a message saying that test one was called. And then it would run our keyword test uh, that we had specified. This concludes our video on calling tests from each other. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact us at the email addresses you see on the screen. And in the meantime, we wish you luck and hope you enjoy automating your tests with TestComplete.